Hey guys, welcome to Cora Radar, your one-stop shop for tips and tricks in the digital world. Today we'll talk about what to do when iPhone storage full can't delete photos. So, as your iPhone always pops up the iPhone storage is full alert, you decide to clear up space by deleting some unneeded photos. Head to the Photos app, select the photos, tap the trash bin icon and you're good to go. It's not a big deal until you find the deleted photos come right back after the deletion. And none of these removed pictures are appearing on the recently deleted album. If you're confused and have no idea why your iPhone won't let you delete photos when storage is full, we're here to help. Keep watching to learn the causes and we'll show you exactly how to fix it. Why won't your iPhone let you delete photos to free up storage? Many factors might cause failure on photos deletion when having full iPhone storage. The low memory makes the Photos app or the system not function properly. More space is required for photos removal. The pictures are stored on iCloud or synced from a computer instead of being saved on the device locally. Now check the step-by-step -step guide for how to delete photos on iPhone when storage is full. They work for all iPhone models running from older iOS versions like iOS 12 to later iOS versions like iOS 18. Besides, if you have any questions, Write it down in the comment below and we'll reply to you within 24 hours. Force the device to restart itself. This is always a good step to fix any problem with your iPhone, including the failure to delete photos. It clears out the temporary files that are corrupted due to the limited storage on iPhone. Just use the physical buttons only to force reboot the phone. The combination to do that might be vary depending on different iPhone models. In an iPhone 8 or newer models, Press and quickly release the volume up key and volume down key. Then, press and hold the side key until the Apple logo appears. In the iPhone 7 series, press and hold both the volume down key and side key until the Apple logo appears. In an iPhone 6s or older models, press and hold both the home key and the sleep or wake key until the Apple logo appears. After that, unlock your device and go to the Photos app. Select a few pictures to delete and see if the deletion works when iPhone storage is almost full. Empty recently deleted album in the settings app. Are you the kind of iPhone user who just keeps moving unused photos to the recently deleted album but never empty it? If you are, the next thing you should do is to empty the recently deleted album. It's easy to do that in the photos app. If the app doesn't respond and can't delete photos because iPhone storage is full, another option is going through the settings app. Here's what you need to do. Go to the Settings app. Tap on General. Choose iPhone Storage. In the opening page, find and tap on Photos. Scroll down and you'll find the Recently Deleted Album option. Tap the Empty option next to it. Then choose Delete from this iPhone to confirm. Once done, you'll see a green tick icon showing up. Now, the photos should be deleted to free up your iPhone storage space. Delete iPhone photos through iTunes or Finder on a computer. When iPhone storage is full and can't delete photos, it's worth checking where the pictures come from. If you find the photos not deleting off iPhone or synced from your personal computer, then it's normal. Because they can't be deleted directly on iPhone but have to be removed by a new sync from the computer. Here, we'll take iTunes as an example to show you how to do that. If you're using a Mac computer running macOS Catalina 10.15 or later, use Finder instead and the steps are almost the same. All right. Launch iTunes on the computer. Then, connect your iPhone to the computer using a USB cable. Your device should appear there soon. Just click your device icon and choose Photos from the left sidebar. From there, deselect the photos and videos that you no longer need. Choose the Apply button to trigger a new sync. This will copy only the photos and videos you select from the computer to your iPhone while removing the unwanted ones on your iPhone. When the sync ends, head to the Photos app and you should get the iPhone photos to permanently delete and free up the space on an iPhone with full storage. Disable iCloud Photos feature. Some users say that when they tap delete on a photo from a full iPhone storage, it immediately reappears on the camera roll album and fails to move to the trash bin. If you have the same issue, the cause could be the photos syncing from iCloud constantly. To fix the issue, just turn off the iCloud Photos feature then try again. Go to the Settings app. Tap your device name, hit the iCloud option, then choose Photos. If the iCloud Photos are synced this iPhone option is enabled. The easy fix is just to disable the feature. Now, go back to the Photos app and try deleting the photos again. It should now allow you to delete the pictures and videos to free up iPhone space. 
Clear storage on iPhone in other ways. Aside from the photos and videos, your iPhone could store lots of apps and files taking up much space on the system. For example, text messages, app cache, notes, music, browser history, email, etc. If you're unable to delete photos on an iPhone because storage is full, consider sparing some space by removing other files. First of all, check the total storage usage. Go to the Settings app. Tap on General. Choose iPhone Storage. Then, scroll down and you'll see how much space each app consumes. Next, find the apps taking up the most space except for photos. All that's left to do is to delete unused files stored in those apps or remove the apps you don't use anymore. After you free up enough storage space, try deleting photos off your iPhone to see if it succeeds this time. Bring the phone back to its factory defaults. If nothing helps on the issue that iPhone storage full and won't let me delete pictures, a severe scenario is that the phone is malfunctioning totally. The solution here is to back up all your essential files first, then perform a factory reset. Here's what you need to do. Go to the Settings app. Tap on General. Scroll down to the bottom and hit the option named Transfer or Reset iPhone. In the next page, tap Erase All Content and Settings. It'll require you to enter the passcode. Just enter as prompted. Then, browse through the warning carefully and tap Erase iPhone. Your iPhone will then be reset to its factory settings, which may take a few minutes. Once completed, a Hello screen will show up on the device. Quickly set up the phone as a new phone or restore it from the backups you've made on iCloud or a computer. Then, test if you manage to delete images on the device. And there you have it, folks. We've reached the end of our video on how to fix when you cannot delete pictures because iPhone storage is full. Thank you for watching, and we wish you the best of luck in deleting unused photos to free up space again. If you did, please consider liking and buying this video a super thanks. Your support means a lot to us to deliver more tech-related content. Until next time.